But first tonight, playoff baseball is back in South Philly, and the Phillies take care of business in Game 1 of the Wild Card Series, beating the Marlins. Good evening, everyone. I'm Yuki Washington. I'm Jessica Cartalia. The game just ended. Sports Director Don Bell will join us in just a minute with all the game action. But first, CBS Philadelphia's Alicia Roberts caught up with fans who are ready for a long postseason run. First game of the playoffs. Everything's lit. Postseason baseball is back at the bank. Go Philly! Let's go Philly! Let's go Philly! Even before the parking lots opened, fans were already honking, hollering, and waving their Philly signs with pride. We're hoping the place rocks tonight, like it did <laughs> last year. We're gonna, we'll do we're our, gonna help. we'll do our part. Phillies faithful know how much home field advantage and the fervor of these fans matter when everything is on the line. When you're in there, it's it's crazy. It feels like you're. It feels like it's a like 5.5 plus on the Richter scale. Many could be seen wearing their Phillies pride on full display. Right here, Bryce Harper. On the leg, we got World Series champs Chase Utley right here. Some couldn't help but get emotional, noting the magic of this game in this city, surrounded by those you love. Oh, my girls are with me. My husband lives in Alabama and he got us tickets, so we're so excited. As the first pitch got underway, the sold out crowd went to work. Rally towels in hand. As soon as we got in there, you could feel that like it was a different sort of environment than a normal season game. Oh, electric, great. electric, great game, great game. Freaking fantastic! It was really amazing, yeah. It was amazing. For this is Red October, and these fans are ready. You could just feel it in your soul. It was freaking amazing. Go Phils! Go Phillies! Go Phils! Come on, let's go, Phillies! Alicia Roberts, CBS News, Philadelphia.